channel learn to teach hairstyles for those who don't know me my name is Carrie and we have a guest her name is Madeline please show her some love we used her a while back so if you haven't seen it go check it out right here this channel is all about learning new and different hairstyles so if this is your first time here we would love for you to subscribe and if you're already a subscriber we thank you and we love you so much for your support today is such a special treat for me because I don't get to do short hair very often so we're gonna show you guys how to do three simple hairstyles for short hair. So let's get started. The first style I'm gonna show you is the diagonal Dutch pancake braid. I went ahead and lightly crimped her hair so that it gives some texture and volume. You don't have to do this if you don't want, but it does help to have the braid stay in place. Anything I use in this video, I'll leave a link in the description box below. So you're going to pick up a section diagonally across your head, split it into three equal parts, and you want to cross the right strand under the middle strand, and you want to pick up a small section right here and add it to that strand here. Now you want to take the left strand and bring it under the middle, and you want to add a section but not so far to here because you want to leave a little bit here so you want to just take a small section from right here and add it to this this strand here so now you want to take the right strand under the middle strand and you want to add this part right to this strand so take a section and add it to this strand here now you want to go to the left and this is all repeated you take the left strand under the middle Grab a small section right here, not, not close to her forehead, but just right here. And then go ahead and take the right strand under the middle and you just keep on going. But before you keep going, you want to pull out the outside. You want to just pancake this out right here. Just pancake that out as far as you want, as big as you want. And same on the other side. Now go ahead and continue to add more hair to this strand and now you want to go to the right, go under and add. Then you take the other strand to the right, bring it under the middle and add. And before you go any further, just pull out, pancake them out. And that's all there is to it. I'm gonna go ahead and speed it up a little faster. I'm going to stop adding hair on each side and just continue the braid and pull out as I go along. So I'm going to stop here because she's got some strands that are sticking out and I'm going to secure it off with an elastic band. Then I'm going to go back and pancake these to the way I like them. And if you notice that she's got some strands that are out, it's okay, you can spray them with hairspray. And once you're done, you're gonna take this and you're gonna hide it. So you're gonna bring this all the way back to the side here, put it out of the way. So I'm gonna go ahead and use some bobby pins and secure them off right here. I'm gonna secure this bobby pin in the shape of an X so it locks in place. 
Okay, you can let this go. Put this right here. Hide it. And then you're gonna go back with this braid and then just tweak it and then add some hairspray. Just to tame those flyaways and shape these little strands that are sticking out. If you like it this way, you can leave it just like this. I'm gonna go ahead and give it some body right here. There you have it. Final spin. So I say one, two, three, give me your love again. The second braid we're gonna show you is a forward lace braid, which the braid will lay right in front of her face. Okay, so I'm gonna take a small section from the top forehead, right here. Then I'm gonna split it into three equal pieces. Now I'm gonna take the right strand over the middle, and I'm gonna take a section right here, a small section, and add it to this strand. Now I'm gonna take the left strand over the middle, and it's just like basically a, a stitch of a braid. So take the right strand over the middle. Now go ahead and add a section right here to this strand. And all you're doing is adding this section to the side strand, to the right side of the strand, nothing on the left, okay? So again, I'm gonna go ahead and add. This is all repeated. So you're gonna add a section to the strand. Bring this left over to the middle. Bring this over to the middle. And just keep adding. That's it. And before you add more, you're just gonna pull right here. You're gonna pancake just the outside of the left strand. Then you can just go ahead and continue. I'm gonna go ahead and fast forward this a little bit. So I'm going to stop right here, secure it off with an elastic band. Then I'm going to go back over and just pull out these sides, pancake them out to the way I like it until I'm satisfied with it. Then I'm going to take this and hide it right under here, okay? I'm going to hide it with uh, bobby pins. And take this up here and then tease it just to give it some volume up on top. And there you have it. A little hairspray. Final spin. Now the third style we're gonna show you is a flower accent braid, which will be right here on the side. And it's gonna be here and here. You wanna start by taking a chunk right here from the side and start making a braid. So all you're doing is just braiding it. And then with this braid, you're gonna go ahead and take just the outside of the right side of this braid and pancake them out. You can uh, expand these out as far as you want. The further you expand this out, the bigger your flower is going to look. Okay, so I'm gonna secure this with an elastic band. So you're gonna take this tail here and just put it right behind this braid, tuck it in, and then just go ahead and roll it into a flower. Then you go ahead and secure it off with a bobby pin behind the flower right behind the braid. I'm gonna do another one. I'm just gonna take a small section here and go ahead and braid it. And then I'm just gonna pull out again. This is pretty simple. Here's that little accent of a flower on the side if you don't wanna be too fancy. Okay, so you're just gonna go ahead, tuck that in and roll and place bobby pins right here. Little hairspray. 
And there you have it. Final spin. There's a plan behind it. Thank you guys so much for watching. We hope you enjoyed these tutorials and find value in them. We're always up for a good challenge, so if you know any styles that you would like us to recreate, please let us know in the comment section. We love feedback, so let us know about your success in following our videos and what parts we might be able to improve on. Don't forget to give us a thumbs up and click our logo below so you don't miss any of our upcoming tutorials. Also, click on the notification bell right next to the subscribe button. To watch more of us, click on over there. Until next time, learn it, do it, and teach it to others. Bye guys. Bye, God bless.